Yo. Yo. My pod. Yo, side. Where you at? I'm about to go downstairs. Oh, for sure. Do you bring your car? No, I just, I just walked here. Oh, for sure. What's up, bruh? What's up? See you off today? Nah, later. Oh, shit. I gotta clean the garage real quick. That shit is dirty. And I, I got new shelves too. Right now we're gonna assemble the shelves because look at the garage. Everything is on the floor. And let's go. All right, so we just finished cleaning the garage, so you guys can see. I don't know if you guys can see that, but so much cleaner. Clutch garage shelves. Shout out to my girlfriend for buying that. All uh, right, now we're gonna jump start the car like always and bring it in the garage and start working on it. Okay. Push it start. Yeah. And then click it. Uh, the signal is like so low, that's why it's draining the battery. Sheesh. Uh, you push it, push it down, and then first gear. Bro, that shit is bouncy. You should drive it around here first. Dip with the car, bro. Where is he? Oh, he's coming. I can hear it. Nah, I feel like he's struggling reversing that. Oh, he's coming. Damn, that shit's loud. That's like my first time hearing that pops in person. Like literally right beside me. Nah, that shit's loud, yo. Yeah, reverse it. <laughs> Exactly. Oh my goodness. Look, look how he's getting out. <laughs> oh my god. I don't know if I want to put mine And that's with it. a top down, which is easier to get out. Yeah. Man. How can you pop the hood too? Yeah. You gotta disconnect the battery. Alright, so right now we're gonna remove the bright seat and go back to my OEM because delaying that shit for almost two years, it is not fun. And I don't know. I'm gonna sell it. If you, so if you guys wanna buy it, DM me on Instagram, Mr. Yada, selling it for $1,200. And if you guys drive the N drive a ND, I'm gonna hook you guys up with a seat bracket. Just hit me up with a, in the DM section, you know? All right, so we, we just got the OEM seat for the car. And we got the OEM trunk as well. I don't know if you guys can see it all the way over there. I decided that I am going to sell my carbon Miata 
uh, duckbill spoiler for the RF. I don't know. <clears throat> I had this trunk for almost two years. Maybe two years since I am going off with a V3 with a different build. I might as well, you know, change the whole look other than just a wrap. This is the OEM trunk. I did put a duck bill on it from eBay. I'm gonna take that off and probably sell it as well for cheap because I don't need it. I'm going with a different duck bill. If you know, you know. One of the reasons why I'm selling the trunk too, the carbon fiber trunk, is because I've been seeing a lot of RF people, maybe in Cali, that kind of rocks the same trunk and before it was just me here in the US but it's time for a change you guys can see I have my fender here I just need the passenger fender and then we're good to go but for now let's disconnect the battery the negative just so the airbag doesn't pop this is 10 mil once we get that off there will be four screws this one right there on the seat bracket and then uh, disconnect some wiring and that, that's it Yeah, I know you see the drip and you like it Wanna text me but your pride tryna fight it I know you young chasing love tryna find it Then I saw you at a party so do I want you So do you want me? If I said I love you, would you love me? I can never dub you, but can you dub me? Yeah, I wanna fall in love, I don't think it's for me Hope you know I want you, so do you want me? If I said I love you, would you love me? I can never dub you, but can you dub me? Yeah, I wanna fall in love, I don't think it's for me I ain't no regular nigga When we pull up to the party, man, the party Bigger, all right, so we just finished installing the seat. How long did it take? An hour. That shit was a long time. Once we installed it, we had to remove the whole seat again just because we missed a step. Now it's good. You want to check it, bro? Uh, let's plug back the negative terminal. And let's see. Okay. Let's see. Let's There's see. no check engine for now just because... The ECU reset it, for sure a couple of drives is gonna pop back on. It's more comfortable, huh? Yeah, comfortable. Bryce is back here. You can also pop the trunk. And now it's time to replace this trunk. Wait. Huh? What happened? Where's the seatbelt buckle? What do you mean? <gasps> There's no way. Where's your seatbelt buckle, bro? <laughs> bro, it's right here. Oh my god. Oh, Let's see. Alright, so we're making a O'Reilly's run because the seatbelt buckle boat. I need an OEM one and I lost it a long time ago. Sheesh. You guys probably seen this car before. Look at the tilt on that. That cold start is fucking loud and longer. Jeez. Passenger princess for the day, you know the vibes. Suspension is not stiff at all, bruh. We just guess. I mean, we didn't guess. We're like 80%, right? Yeah. All right, so this is our third time running in the store. We went to O'Reilly's two times and AutoZone one time. Hopefully this is it because we've been working on this fucking seat for three hours now. I think. Come on. <gasps> yeah. yeah! Okay, cool, cool, cool. Oh there my go, okay. gosh, bro. Okay, cool, cool, cool. We're just going back and forth. So if you guys are curious what bolt we use, it is a M10 1.25. To all the ND owners with a stock seat and you lost your bolt. There you go. 
Yes, we can finally install this seat. And I'm gonna be able to use the seat belt. All right, so we finally put on the seat. All good to go. Kind of having trouble a little bit, but we finished it. It took about like five hours, maybe like three hours. Yeah. Bright seat right there. If you guys want it, make sure you guys DM me at Mr. Yada on Instagram. This shit is still pretty mint, yo. Comes with everything, the boat you need, just so you guys doesn't have to go back to O'Reilly's 10 times. All right, so we're currently here at Sherty. We gonna get, grab some drink real quick. Look at the car right now. The, the tent is chroming. Let it focus. It's not focusing. All right, right there. But no, I want something not too sweet. Maybe that lemonade is still No? I might get that. I got a orange honey lemonade with try crystal it. boba. Sour. Try it. it. Tastes like lemonade. Good. What? What is that? Why is those weird balls or whatever? It's a crystal honey. So it's been two days since the last clip that you guys saw. The camera died on me. I don't know how. Last time I checked, it was at three bar, which is full battery. And I don't know where it just cut off. But we haven't done the trunk yet. And I might as well put it in the same video and knock this down for y'all so we can upload it. And let me show you guys the trunk right now. So this is how the trunk is looking. It's kind of dirty. Definitely need some work but it's not bad still so in my opinion this is one of the best trunk for the ndrf the one on the soft top version the duck bill on those is not really as aggressive as this one it's versatile in my opinion but i am planning to sell it i'm selling it for 400 dollars right now it does come in with the led strip light i don't know if you guys let me show you guys real quick so yeah it does come in with the led um strip light i think that costs maybe around $75 on Fly Me Out of website. So I am gonna put my stock trunk for now. It does come in with the little duck bill. So you guys can see real quick this is my stock one there's a carbon fiber i really love that trunk but i had it for two years now and i think it's time for a change that's why i'm doing this we are gonna do a little setback put on stock seat put on stock trunk and we're gonna pop off soon just trust the process trust the process but now let's throw on the trunk it's pretty easy we just took off four 10 mil bolts it's down there and that's about it. Oh, we are gonna have to switch this trunk latch back to the stock one. And let's do it. It's been so long since I thought about you. I swear, okay, baby, I'm back. I guess you want the one for me. It's been so long since I thought All right, we just finished putting on the trunk. As you guys can see, you guys ready for this? Let's get it. All right, let's close it down. Let's see how it looks. Oh my, oh my. Damn, that shit look ugly. The little duck bill in the back makes it look okay. But I'm not really a fan of stock trunk. I feel like, you know, the carbon fiber is way better, obviously. But for now, we're gonna 
stick with this so we can sell this. Hopefully we can sell it fast just so we can start on this process faster. V3 is coming. A whole new look for this car is coming. A little hint right here. You guys can see. But hey, that's for a different video. But for now, what do you guys think? Uh, I definitely like that way better. Driving that shit to work is way comfortable. And I've been driving the car with the bucket seat for like a year, a year and a half. It was so uncomfortable. On 50K spring, nah, that, that ain't it. All right guys, so this is gonna be the end of the video. Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, and let me know how the trunk looks. By the way, I'm selling this lip tooth for probably like 50 bucks if you guys wanna want it. If you guys made it to the end of the video, Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Make sure you guys tune in because there's a lot of stuff that is coming for this car. Peace.